Hi, I'm Amy, and welcome to Early Literacy Storytime at the Heartland Public Library. Let's get started with our song. Two little feet go tap, tap, tap. Two little hands go clap, clap, clap. A quick little leap from out of your chair. And two little arms wave high in the air. Two little legs go jump, jump, jump. And two little fists go thump, thump, thump. One little body spins round and round. And one little person sits quietly down. Yay! Oh my goodness, good morning. It is Tuesday and it felt really warm outside today when I went out. I think it's a gorgeous day and rain might be on the way. Today, we are going to read, Is Everyone Ready for Fun? by Jan Thomas. And it is published by Simon and & Schuster. And let me see, when, did, when was this book published? It was published in 2011. So is everyone ready for fun? Are you ready? Oh, look. Here we have our three cows. One, two, three. Look, it's chicken's sofa. Oh, there it is, the sofa. Some people call it a couch, but these, these three, these three cows, they call it a sofa. <gasps> Plop onto the sofa. Oh my goodness, it's a small sofa for three cows. <laughs> Is everyone ready for fun? Oh, I don't know. There's our chicken. Chicken look ready. It's time to jump up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. Let's all jump up and down on chickens. So far. Wait a minute, says Chicken. There's no jumping on my sofa. No, no, no. Oh, okay, Chicken. We won't jump on your sofa. Is everyone ready for more fun? Chicken says, more fun? It's time to dance back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. It's time to dance back and forth on chicken sofa. What are you doing now, says chicken. You said not to jump on your sofa. And we weren't jumping. Hmm. Okay. Is everyone ready for some even more fun? And chicken says, no more fun. It's time to wiggle. To and fro, to and fro, wiggle, 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 to and fro, to and fro. Let's all wiggle to and fro on chicken sofa. Enough. There'll be no more jumping, dancing, or wiggling on my sofa. <sighs> Bad cows. Then there's only one thing left for us to do. What do you suppose it is? <gasps> is everyone ready? Chicken might not be. It's time to <gasps> nap. <gasps> Napping on my sofa? Yes. Good idea. Wake up. Yay. Oh, I love that. Is everyone ready for fun? It's like Jan Thomas, one of my favorites, because you jump and it's on chicken sofa. Yeah. Okay, so let's do.
do, let's do, um, how about a hokey pokey? And we will put a hand in, and then we'll put an elbow in, and then we'll put our heads in. How about that? Okay. So you put your hand, you put your hand in, you take your hand out, you put your hand in, and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. You put your elbow in, you take your elbow out. You put your elbow in, you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. You put your head in, you put your head out. You put your head in and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Yay, so much fun. So you can put your foot, you can put your kneecap in. You could put your left hip in. There's so you just, you could go on and on with the hokey pokey and you turn yourself about because that's what it's all about. Yay. Next, we have a book. It's kind of a, it's a song. It's called Five Little Ducks. And the illustration is by Penny Ives. And let me see, it's a board book. So it's in our board book collection. And it's classic books with holes. And let me see when it was published. Oh my goodness, 2002 by Child's Play International. Okay, five. Five little ducks went out one day over the hills and far away. Let's count our ducks here first. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, we have five ducks. Mother duck quacked, quack, 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 quack. But only one, two, three, four little ducks came back. Hmm. Ooh, a fox. Four little ducks went out one day over the hills and far away. Mother duck called quack, 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 quack. But only one, two, three little ducks came back. Only three, three little ducks. One, two, three. Three little ducks went out one day over the hills and far away. Mother duck called quack, 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 but only one, two little ducks came back. Only two. Mm. Oh, and here we have our two ducks. Two ducks. Oh, and a big frog. Two little ducks went out one day over the hills and far away. Mother duck called quack, 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 quack. But only one little duck came back. Oh my goodness. Oh, we have a beautiful rainbow. Let's go. One little duck went out one day over the hills and far away. Mother duck called quack, 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 quack. But no little ducks came back. No little ducks. No little ducks went out one day over the hills and far away. Mother duck called quack, 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 quack. What do you suppose? We suppose, oh, and five little tiny ducks came wandering back. Yay, let's count. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, and let's do a little bit more counting here because that's fun. There are three flowers. One, two, three. One big dragonfly and one, is that the frog? And a fish. Yay, that was 
the board book by Little Ducks, illustrated by Penny Ives. And that, my friends, is story time for today. And I hope all of you have a wonderful day. Stay well, have fun, and keep reading. Bye-bye. I'll see you next week.